Oh, geez. Well, you know what? We'll do. <laughs> I was just going to restart this video, but whatever. Let's just. What's going on, Legion? Asriel here, like always. And sometimes there's errors. Uh, yeah, this is Fear the Walking Dead, <clears throat> a show that I almost completed. Uh, season one. Almost got through it. I, I forgot what happened. I think it was around the same time. I had a 10 hour job and I just didn't have the time. I just, I'm about to sneeze. Why now? This camera gives my nose cancer. I swear on me, mom. Um, but yeah, I, I, uh, I didn't get to finish Fear of the Walking Dead, but I'm going to be checking out all the normal Walking Dead, all three seasons that I've missed. And I'll probably end up going in straight into Fear of the Walking Dead. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, through the, the episodes that I missed, uh, as I watch season seven of Walking Dead, and then get on to, and then just kind of, enter, you know, do multiples like that. Because I think that'd be cool. I think that'll work out pretty well, hopefully. So with that, let's just get into it, check it out, see what uh, it's all about. Words hard, Englando, please. Oh. Let's actually hear stuff, please. And the shit hits the fan. Oh shit. Yeah, it Definitely hit the fan, I told you. He's just military? No. God damn, dude. Shit is just going down. They look like soldiers. Probably not. Familiar. Stars shine bright. Damn, people just be dying like crazy. Hey, white people. Damn. Yeah. I wonder if he was a character that was like known. Oh yeah. So you don't turn into a zombie. That's right. Well, damn, dude. Shit. I actually liked Fear the Walking Dead when it came out. Everybody was hating on it. I'm already hating these guys in the suits, the uniforms. Oh, damn. What up, girl? I was a big fan of the show working on it. It was just unfortunate that I think that work and everything else just kind of got in the way and just never got to finish it. It was something that never really piqued my interest, I think, fully. Like, I was a huge fan of The Walking Dead where, like, addictive. Like, I gotta watch the next episode. I gotta check it out. And this was just, like, a little, like, extra. It wasn't bad. It wasn't, like, worse or anything like that. It was just, I don't know. It was just something about it. It was just different or... You know, maybe the, the rumor of, you know, money ploy and, you know, shitty people is what a lot of people were saying. when Oh, they're making another Walking Dead. You know, season three was garbage and The Walking Dead is just a shit show. Now they're going to make more and try to make more money. Those are a lot of things that I heard. A lot of people like, you know, making their opinions on online really just kind of you know, crapping on the show. And I kind of enjoyed it. I didn't really get to finish it, though, and I think that's what I'll probably end up doing as I get to Season 7 uh, for Walking Dead. I'll definitely finish up Fear the Walking Dead, and I'll probably end up checking out uh, whatever else they have coming out for Fear the Walking Dead, because I think it's going to be good, man. It's just going to be a Walking Dead bonanza. I mean, I'm not really somebody... I, I put myself in every show that I watch for the most part. Like, how would I react to it? Dude, the freaking just... 
like depression that these characters feel it's just so much man it's just so depressing i remember i i talked to my dad and i said hey why don't you check out this show it's really cool he watched one episode and said this show's fucking stupid <laughs> i go why he goes i hate that guy that the, the sheriff i'm like what do you mean he's like no i just couldn't get i couldn't get around him he was like, he was like just a, i hate that dude <laughs> and he's like i hate the other guy the, the ball guy i'm like that dude is awesome what do you mean? I forget Daryl's brother. I can't remember his name. And he's like, I'm like, you didn't even give like the full sh- the full episode, you know, a thing. You should watch the next episode. The dude gets fucked up. And he's like, and then eventually he's just like, I hate post apocalyptic stuff. He goes, I get enough depression on the on the news. I don't need to be watching TV shows like that. And I go, oh, okay, I can I can deal with that. I can understand where you're coming from, because the show is just depressing in some ways. But that's good writing. It's good writing to have the ups and the downs. But it's The Walking Dead and Fear the Walking Dead. And whenever something good happens, in the back of my mind, I know that the writers are like, let's just build it up. Let's just, no, it's like a roller coaster. Let's just keep going. And, but they're backwards, so they're never going to know when the drop comes, right? And it's going to be like the worst thing. Main character dies. This person goes, the world's a shit show and a half. I, it's in that aspect it's almost predictable writing but then it's awesome when they kind of uh you know get you off center and you end up start watching um you know it's like oh it's gonna be bad coming up and then it's just not as bad as you thought or it's way worse than you could ever imagine like cannibals or whatever but with that i'm gonna get out of here guys thanks for watching thanks for hanging out if you like the video like the content you can always like subscribe or share remember it's quite up to you i do appreciate it though and if you want to talk about anything on this video on this channel specifically you can always leave a comment down below love to see love to hear all the comments you can uh check out all my links down below if you wish and once again my name is azrael and i'll see you on whatever video i'm doing next later guys again thanks for watching thanks for hanging out thanks for being a part of the legion i'll see you later